We're the Real Housewives of New York City, and today we're playing Never, Never Have, Have I, I Ever, Ever. ever. Oh, <laughs> ever. ever. Oh, sorry. Never have I ever Googled myself, Dorinda. I've Googled myself a lot. Every day. Well, I don't have Google alerts. I just Google myself to check it out because I don't like Google Do alerts. Do you have a Google alert? No. No. Because I don't want to get all that not information. Good. But every once in a while, you got to check. Right. So I think everyone probably Googles themselves every once in a while. Yes. I have a Google alert on John. It's I'm always good. here. I'm always watching <laughs> from everywhere. No one has a Google alert on me. I'm so upset. Us Weekly does. Yes. <laughs> Never have I ever been fired from a job. No, I haven't. I haven't either. People love me to work for them. We come from that generation where you didn't get fired from your job. Right. You work hard and you stay at your company and show up on time. Up. I think I might have gotten fired from a babysitting job. Oh. But I was only 13. Never have I ever sexted the wrong person. I've never sexted, period. <laughs> yeah. does, does sexting include a photo or is it just words? I've never done that either. Okay. I don't do that. I, Remember, I, say I, it, forget it. Write it, regret it. it. <laughs> exactly. All right, I'm drinking. I've been asked to send a topless picture, but I've never done it. Yeah. And I, then I stopped talking to that person. Yeah. Never have I ever joined the Mile High Club. That means having sex in a plane. Yes. Private or commercial. <laughs> Private or commercial. Yeah. I, I don't even believe that it exists. It what are you talking about? Of course, I don't too believe small. people are having sex They're not in commercial small when you're on like airlines. A BBJ, all right. Well, on There's private a planes. Back there. On private planes, maybe, but on commercial. They're not that big, even on the BBJs. They're not Seriously. that big. You've got a huge bedroom. No, the bedroom. But the Mile High Club, you have to have it in the bathroom. <laughs> This is so much grosser than I ever imagined it would be. No, you have to have it oh, on no. in the plane. It in the plane. Oh, no, I oh, thought. Oh, that? <laughs> <laughs> Never have I ever dropped my name for a reservation. I have. I have. I said. <laughs> Even before I was on the Housewives in New York City. Account, bro. Are you dropping my name? Or your... <laughs> I'll drop my name, your name, her name, and anyone else I can pull out of my contact list. <laughs> Never have I ever enjoyed Luann's music. Gold, diamonds, caviar, life is but a dream. When every day you're living in is featured on TV. <laughs> I'm pleading the fifth on that. It's very catchy. Actually, no, it is. Money can buy you class. I like any I'll kind of music where you can yeah. when you can repeat the verses easily over I'll, and over right, again. Exactly, it's not hard to remember that one. Very 80. Good times. That's, that's not one of her songs. But that's what it's like. It's like those songs. <laughs> Leave your Friends behind. Cares, cares. <laughs> Friends, that's a carol. Never have I ever enjoyed a skinny girl margarita. <laughs> <laughs> Careful. I think we have in Mexico. Yes. By the way, getting some food into all of us wouldn't be a terrible idea. We've eaten tequila all day. Yes. They're delicious. Never have I ever done an interview intoxicated. Uh uh. No, I've, I've never, I can honestly say, I've never done an interview. I don't think I've ever seen Carol intoxicated. She's never. It's really Excuse annoying. Excuse me. Before. Yes, in Mexico, I was drunker than all of us. No. Well, where the hell is everyone? Yes, I was. I'm just. By the way, there. that's a compliment. Oh. I mean, well, you know, I'm getting well, peer pressure. Never have I ever gone through my significant other's phone. No comment. What do we Zero do? We drink if we. Mm, if we have it, we have it. Can I just I down this? Oh, <laughs> Listen, what girl has not gone through her significant other's phone at one point or another? You know what? But you're never happy when you do. Yeah, don't do it.